This is Hawaii News Now. Welcome back. But over the years, Kahuku has become well known for turning out top tier football talent. Oh, yeah, but one former Red Raider is making a name for himself overseas in professional rugby. Jim Mendoza introduces us to Roman Salanoa. During his football playing days, Roman Salanoa was a standout at Kahuku High School. He was a big kid with an impressive highlight reel. But on his way to a college scholarship, another sport came calling that would send him in an entirely different direction. So I went from signing with junior college in football to signing again with the rugby team in Lindenwood, Missouri. That was just the start. He's now 25 and lives in Ireland, where he plays the rough and tumble game of professional rugby. So it's just kind of full on smack, smacking into each other. But then there's just a lot of different techniques and stuff like that go along with it. But yeah, there is a lot of pressure in, this, in the scrums. The North Shore native of Samoan, Hawaiian and Italian descent plays for Munster, a team in the United Rugby Championship, which is one of Europe's three professional rugby leagues. Matches are played in sold out stadiums and the competition on the field is fierce. Yeah, we play at a high level of rugby. Roman has played at that high level for six years. He made the big adjustment from living on Oahu to living in the south of Ireland. I grew up in a small town, so you really only know what's there and then you move, move across the country move to another country and it's you get exposed to a whole new a whole new lifestyle a whole new like mindset his rugby reputation is on the rise this year he was invited to participate in advanced camps that could serve as the gateway to competing on the international level which is the highest in rugby oh i'm also very lucky with that as well <laughs> very grateful there are perks that come with a career. The pay is good, and he gets to see the sights. Besides Ireland, matches take him to France, Italy, Wales, England, Scotland, and South Africa. Living abroad has even snuck into his vocabulary. Like I'd say, lads, like lads instead of like the boys, or cheers instead of thank you. <laughs> Roman graduated from Kahuku in 2015. He still tries to keep up with the Red Raiders football team, but it isn't easy when you're 7,000 miles away in a foreign country. Luckily, there's a few aunties and uncles from back home that live stream it on Facebook. <laughs> After this rugby season is over, Roman and his girlfriend, Roisin, will visit Hawaii so he can catch up with his family and friends and give his body a break. Shout out to the 808. Let's go. <laughs> Call the line out of self, and here they go. Rugby has a long history in the 50th state, but it wasn't even a blip on Roman's radar back in high school. Fortunately, a rugby coach saw his potential, and now he's in the big leagues. I'm Jim Mendoza for Hawaii News Now. Absolute beast. <laughs> Fun Ooh. story right there. And I can imagine uh, the power run game from Kahuku really helped mold that rugby style right there. I love the language, lads. Lads Cheers. instead of boys. <laughs> Cheers instead of thank you. That's right. Well, thanks for watching First at Four. Here's what's coming up in our next half hour. The state